If you have a problem, pull this handle. It signals us and we arrive in the blink of an eye. So then we kidnap the king, and then we tell everyone in the village he's retired, and bam, I take his place and become the new Mandrill King. So, is that a plan or what? Uh, I said, or what? Uh, uh, yeah, I think that's a great plan. Especially the part when I said, that's a great plan. Uh, but I didn't understand the plan part. Could you explain it again? Okay, for the last time. There, you see these four mandrels? That's us. I'll even draw my turban. He draws really good. Yeah, you can tell what it is right away. Shh, focus. That's the mandrel king. You'll know him by his crown. Every day the king goes on a walk around the beaver pond. So we dress up as beavers and wait for him on the other side. When he passes by, we kidnap him, lock him in a box, and then we'll send him to the other side of the world. Then we'll tell the village that he's retired and bam, I take his place. And I become the new king of the Mandros! Oh, see, when it's drawn like that, it's a lot easier to understand. One thing, is the king okay with being kidnapped? Ugh. The king doesn't know about our plan. That's how kidnappings work. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you don't get it, just say so. First, any of you know what a kidnapping is? Uh, a short sleep in the afternoon? No, that's napping. We've gone over this for hours, and you don't even know what kidnapping means? Uh, sir, can a stone move by itself? Huh? Since when do stones move by themselves? <laughs> That's not a stone! He knows our plan! If the king talks to that elephant, we're finished! Let's get him! Not damn Marie, during your brief absence, I will do my best to shoulder the responsibilities that usually fall upon you. No, 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 that's too formal. Don't worry, Maurice. When you're gone, I'll handle everything. Yeah, that's not bad. Gilbert, <laughs> Maurice and Junior are leaving now. Don't you want to say goodbye? Yes, yes, I'm coming. Are you ready, Junior? Well, then we're good to go. All right. Ready to leave for your little tiger vacation? Yes, a survival weekend in the most dangerous places of the jungle. It's going to be great. See you soon. Uh, Maurice? I don't want to delay you, but don't you think you should maybe name a new head of the jungle bunch while you're gone? Mm-hmm. Not a bad idea, Gilbert. So the new temporary leader of the jungle bunch is... Hmm... Hmm... <laughs> Patricia. All right, see ya. Ciao. Patricia, now great tiger warrior. Well, congratulations, Patricia. Thank you, Gilbert. I don't have the experience that Maurice has, but I'll try to replace him the best I can my own way. Your own way? What do you mean? Are you going to change the way things are done? But, Patricia, habits are important. They're even vital. Without them, we have random acts, improvisation, uh, and chaos. Hello, Jungle Bunch. I'm Ronald. And I need your help. Calm down. Breathe deep. You're safe here. You seem a little stressed. Not to mention just showing up like that, not even using the signal, and we're supposed to find that normal? I'm so sorry. But I'm being chased by a group of mandrels. I don't know what they want from me. I only know that they're planning a dirty trick on the Mandrel King. I'm guessing they didn't like that I overheard him talking about it. Um, can you turn around for a second, please? I think that might have to do with this. It looks like a detailed map of the kidnapping plans. I'm guessing they want to make sure that no matter what, the Mandrel King doesn't see it. Oh yeah? Oh, then we just have to erase the drawing and all is good, right? But we can't do that. This drawing is important evidence. We need to escort you to the Mandrel King to show him. He has to know that somebody is trying to kidnap him. A main guy who drew a Machiavellian plan on an elephant. A mission starting at the pond. I have a bad feeling about this. Don't worry, nothing will happen to you while you're with the Jungle Bunch. Uh, okay, all right. I trust you. Uh, I'll follow you. <sighs> the elephant's protected by the bunch. That changes things. We need a new plan. Hey, guys, I think that if we do this... Oh, yeah. That's great. <laughs> Sir, I think we have an awesome plan to catch him. Y you actually have a plan? Let's be on alert. We don't know what ingenious means they'll use to try and catch us. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, that was far. Miguel, can you take care of them? <laughs> yes! <laughs> the bee! The bee! The bee! Okay, let's go. It should be fine now. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. From now on, just let me handle all the plans? Okay. Shade, do you want me to get sunburned? Come on, go away. <laughs> Ronald, we're almost at the king's. You must be relieved. Ronald, where did he go? Hmm, peanuts. Interesting. And Miguel found banana. <laughs> Wait a second! <gasps> the mandrel are trying to trap him! We have to stop them! <laughs> Ronald, you have to stop! The mandrels have set a trap! Well, I can't! Peanuts are so good! It's not my fault, I love them so much! Big Nana feels like food, Mikel understands. Mikel has the same problem with bananas, but Mikel has solution now to stop falling in traps. When Mikel no eat banana during one whole day, Mikel then let Mikel eat two bananas next day. That's quite clever. Uh, but if you don't mind, I think I still prefer to continue eating them today. Mikel warning! Mikel not move! Could you scoot over? I just need one or two more. No, 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 no. Miguel, not move. <laughs> uh, uh, well, okay. Well, I'm just gonna follow you then. Can I eat just one last one? <laughs> no, okay, okay, I'm following you. Oh, no, I don't get it. Why didn't it work? We picked tons of peanuts and elephants love to eat peanuts. Oh, why? Tons of peanuts, what a treat. <laughs> <laughs> Patricia, Maurice would have said it's a bit of a trek. That's true, Gilbert. Maurice would have said that. Then I'll say it. It's a bit of a trek. You know, Patricia, this leader role really suits you. Really? You think so? Yes, I really think so. Uh -huh. What's this? No more fighting. Looks like they want to make peace. So then you admit that you have behaved badly? You don't want to take on Ronald anymore? And the Mandrill King? You really want to apologize? Oh no, look at that race of joy! Yeah! I beat the bus! So am I the boss or am I the boss? Yeah! I'm gonna be the king, yeah! I'm gonna be the king, yeah! I'm gonna be the king, yeah! Uh, without the plan, we have nothing to show the king! What a disgrace! Gilbert, go get the king and bring him here. I have an idea. You're looking at the king, yeah! So well done. Congratulations. You won, and we lost. But I was looking at your drawing, and I must say, I'm not sure I understood everything that it said. I don't even think that the king would have understood it. It was so complicated. Mind your own business. My drawing was clear. Mm, well, I didn't understand it. Well, I drew everything clearly, the path of the king, all of it. Ain't that right? Mm -hmm. uh, <sighs> Why do I bother? See, I told you. They didn't get it either. They don't get anything. I'm used to it. 
Okay, fine. I'll show you what I drew. You're gonna feel foolish when you see how clear my drawing was. There you go. It's even clearer than the original. So there's the king. We kidnap him, then send him to the other side of the world. So do you still not get it? Very interesting. Guards. Oh. Oops. Yay! Yay! Ooh, that was close. It's no picnic replacing Maurice. Are you kidding? You were perfect, Patricia. Oh, Gilbert. You're the one who was perfect, as usual. No, you were even more perfect. Yes, Miguel agrees. That embarrassing. Wow! Well played, Great Warrior Tiger. That was so cool. Victor, you're our biggest fan. It's a joy to put on a show for you. Oh, Great Warrior Tiger, could you tell me again about your very first adventure? Come on, please, please, pretty please. As you know, I gathered the jungle's seven most legendary and courageous warriors. We sailed due south, far from the jungle, all the way to the sea ice. There we rescued funny-looking birds from walruses that were tormenting them. Miguel, remember? Miguel dumped lots of nasty walruses. Miguel, very, very happy. But what happened after that? Did you become a justice team as soon as you got back? Oh, no. When we got back, we all went back to our regular occupations. Ah, it's so good to be back home. On my beloved branch. Hello, in peace. If you don't mind, Gilbert, mm -hmm. I think uh -huh. I'll settle here. Uh -huh. Okay, Junior. Time to start training again. Hey, Al, where are you going? Off on a vacation? No, Maurice. We're moving out. We have to leave the pond. Yeah, George is the elephant and his staff are settled next to the volcano. They're gonna build their city here, so they're pushing out all the animals. Well, that's not very nice at all. And besides, Junior and I have no intention of moving out. I'll just go tell them this behavior is uncalled for. Whoa, Day-Day. Uh huh? Your break is five minutes, not ten. Banana trees are not gonna uproot themselves. Hi there. I just wanted to let you know that you're going to have to build your city elsewhere because the jungle belongs to everybody. There you have it. So thank you for leaving. Farewell. You see, Junior, all you need is to talk to resolve a problem. What are you talking about? We're building the Tusk neighborhood, the classiest spot in the jungle. So you could take your tiger stripes and take a hike. You see, Junior, the gentleman doesn't see that that's no way to speak to the great warrior tiger. But that doesn't mean we yeah, have... Yeah, the gentleman will now demonstrate our very detailed construction methods. So make sure you pay close attention. Hey, elephants, go uh -huh. ahead. Burr, uh, oh. Oh. See this volcanic rock? Uh, yeah. Well, once we've cleared the jungle, we're gonna use it to cover up the ground with it. That way, no more mud sticking to your paws, no grass giving you allergies. It's a win-win. Now that's progress. And it's not a tiger and a half that's gonna stop us. Hmm, so that's how it's gonna be. It's war you're seeking. Banzai! <laughs> it's hot! It's hot! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I understood it would not be easy to stop these crazy pachyderms. Ah, so you went to get the others. That it? Not right away, actually. First, Junior and I together tried to dissuade them. It didn't really work. And that's when you got the others? Right, that's when I got the others. These elephants won't listen to me, so I'm going to need your help to convince them to go build their city elsewhere. You can count on me. We won't let these pachyderms clear-cut the jungle. Miguel don't understand, but Miguel like dumping elephants with Mr. Maurice. Dumpy, dumpy, dumpy! Thanks, friends. I knew I could count on you. And you, Gilbert? Uh, personally, I think these elephants have a really good idea. If they clear the jungle and cover everything with lava, there'll be fewer germs. 
Hmm. Gilbert, if they clear the jungle, you'll need to move out and we'll lose your favorite branch. Uh, what's the story with Gilbert's branch? Oh, you don't know? Well, back in the day, Gilbert was completely obsessed with his branch. He never wanted to leave. I... Miguel carried Grumpy Mouse's branch all the time. Miguel got sore shoulder from that. Okay, and he's over it now? Let's just say that now, his mind is elsewhere. So where was I? Oh, yeah. We were ready to take action. We're ready to take action, friends. Don't you think it would be great to have a team name? A team name? Well, yes, since we're a team of jungle crime fighters, we could call ourselves... The Jungled. No? The Seven Jungle Samurai? Oh, but wait, we're not seven. Full Metal Banana? The Aces? Hmm. What about the new champions? Or the Kamikaze Squad, since we're unlikely to survive this adventure. Huh? Huh? Fine, we can decide this later. Let me explain the Hi, plan friends. of attack. We've brought reinforcements. Yeah, look who's here. Oh, Fred, what a nice surprise. What brings you here? I may be a superstar up on the stage, but I will fight injustice. I can feel your rage. Side by side in battle, this will be supreme. Just say the word. I'll be the new star on your team. No, our team is complete, but you can still help us out with the team name. Could you think of something that has a nice ring to it? It's the perfect mission for Fred the Great. Thanks for asking cool. me. Cool, thank to you, help Fred. Uh, he's already gone. Well, it's our turn now. Come on, hurry up with the wheelbarrow. Ah. Hey, hippos, we need a steamroller over here. Ah. Hey, you there, giraffe, bring the crane over here. Ah. <laughs> hey, beavers, what part didn't you get when I said, cut down the trees, huh? Was it cut or the trees? Come on, get to work. Uh, yes, sir. Hey, beavers, why do you uh -huh. let him treat you like that? What will you gnaw once he's had you cut down all the trees? Huh? And you, hippos. And you, giraffe. Where will you live? Don't listen to him! Get back to work! I warned you, Georges, we're not going to let you cut down this jungle. It belongs to all the animals. Which means you're gonna have to deal with us, the jungled! <laughs> <laughs> no? Okay, what's our name then? Jungled, not jungled, who cares? Soon you'll just be memories. Go pour concrete over these clowns and get back to work! Gilbert, Patricia, find a way to neutralize this lava! Get higher, Patricia! Let's divert the water from this pipe toward the inside of the volcano. Got it, Gilbert. Come on, guys, it's time to rebel. Uh -huh. mm, beavers, you're gonna find you're out of a job. I'll replace you with an army of termites. We're not afraid of you anymore. We're revolting. Perfect timing. I need you. Huh? Miguel, follow me. We have to get this valve open. The water will cool the lava. Okay, Gilbert. Are you ready, son? <laughs> Junior, wait for my signal. Miguel, break the pipe right here. We're going to divert the water into the volcano. <laughs> now, Junior. It's gonna work, it's gonna work, it's gonna... It's working! You two, let's go! Send the lava over here! Hup, 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 hup. It, it broke. broke! Try again, lazy bones! Hup, 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 Don't need hup, to hop now! Yoo hoo, Mr. Chief Elephant, now Miguel dump you! We gotta go! Come hup, hup. back here, you nincompoops! Hippo buddy, Miguel needs steamroller! You're not trumpeting now, huh? Uh, you'll pay for this, you jungled! You'll pay for this! You will pay! No, no, our name is not the jungled, it's... Um... If your luck is the worst around, oh, you need something found. No need for you to fret at all. Give the bunch a call. They're always classy and sometimes sassy. 
When in a crunch call The jungle bun Oh yeah Yeah, Fred The jungle bunch That sounds super cool What do you think, Junior? Did you hear that, friends? The jungle bunch saved us all Hooray! Yay! For the jungle bunch! Yeah! Jungle bunch! And why wouldn't you settle right around here? That way, if someone needs you, they'd know where to find you. That's not a bad idea. It would have to be modified a bit. Hey, we could use the steam from the volcano to make some sort of signal. The jungle. The jungle bunch, 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 bunch. The jungle bunch. And open. And open. And open. And open. Did you see that, Junior? <laughs> Stop it, Maurice. It's working. And so that's how we found our hideout and conducted our first mission. Yeah, that's so cool. I'll go tell all my friends. Thanks, Great Warrior Tiger. See you next time. So long, Victor. Anytime. What are you humming, Patricia? No, nothing. Just something that's stuck in my head. You've got a problem and no way to make it right. The jungle will be there for you to take on. Ah, Patricia, you're my jungled one. Oh, look at all the flies. What a feast. Wait up. There's a blue fly and a red fly. It must be a spider's trap. At the slightest vibration, spiders are going to jump on us. No worries, Bob. I know about diffusing. We just have to get rid of the red fly, and then we can eat in peace. Are you sure? Why not the blue fly? Bob, everyone knows that it's always the red. Uh, you just removed the blue one, Al. Hmm? Huh? Duty calls, my friends. The Jungle Bunch! To the rescue! Good mission! And open. Paquita, what brings you to this part of the world? Little sister! Miguel Happy! Big Brother, it's terrible. I've looked through the jungle. There aren't any bananas left. Hmm. Little sister, no worry. Miguel know all places where banana in jungle. Miguel, show little sister. Do you want us to come? No need, Mr. Maurice. Mission banana, mission for Miguel. Okay, gorillas, have fun picking bananas. Bananas! 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 Bananas? Bananas! Bananas? <sighs> bananas! Bananas! Bananas? Miguel no understand. Here, best spot for banana for Miguel. Always lots of bananas. Psst. Hey, hey, gorillas. You looking for bananas? Come here. I got one. And they could be yours in exchange for almost nothing. Two coconuts, five pineapples, four guavas. <laughs> Admit it, that's a steal. Miguel exchanged banana for three thumpy. Uh, three what? Thumpy! Uh, thumpy! Uh, thumpy! Uh, uh, but what on earth are you two doing? I've been investigating this banana trafficking for weeks. I've been hiding in this bush for four hours waiting for the exchange. And you, you show up and hit my only lead. Big Nonoceros named Goliath. Avenger like Miguel. He doesn't look happy to see you. Hmm. This mandrel was going to lead me to their lair. And you, you messed it all up, novice! Miguel no novice. Miguel, blue gorilla. Huh? Huh? Hey, hey, you! Come back! Miguel chase villain. Dangerous. Paquita no coming. But I want to see you hit villains, big brother. No, little sister go home. <laughs> Miguel, I don't need your help. I'm taking care of this alone, all right? When villains against bananas, villains against Miguel. You are too young and impulsive for this mission. I'll handle it, kiddo. Hey, guys, I need you to get rid of these two. Don't move, 
of you clowns. I've got a hostage. Well, um, hello? Huh? Miguel thump away, bad elephant. But Miguel, he has a hostage. You can't just thump him. Hmm. 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 You have to be cunning. Let's blind him by throwing guavas in his eyes. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Miguel, why'd you do that? Goliath say throw guava in eyes. Not Patrick's eyes, the elephant's eyes. Not Miguel fault. All right, well, no, we're no, off. No. Yep. Goliath fault. Two bananas for hmm. this. That's a great deal. Yep. <sighs> Thanks to you, they got away. Let me take care of it now. I have more experience than you do. I'm an Avenger, a champion, I'll have you know. Miguel also Avenger. Miguel in the Jungle Bunch. Oh, really? Look at this scar, kiddo. I got it fighting a whole herd of elephants. Then the fin's not dangerous. Look, Miguel bite lip eating bananas. That dangerous. And that? Mm -hmm. That's an alligator's teeth marks. Papaya juice. Stay no go away. Even Miguel rub. A lion's attack. Finger twister when Miguel scratch butt cheeks. Bite from a venomous snake. I had to suck it out myself. No, no, uh, well, Miguel. you're getting along better. Let's Miguel sit on ant heel and, uh, mm. Mm. They've been following us since the beginning, boss. Hmm. Goliath. He's an ex-ace champion. And if we let him, he's gonna cause us problems. And Miguel. I know him, too. He's in the Jungle Bunch. If we let him, he's going to... to... Uh, get us in trouble? No, dump us. Oh. We have to stop them from sticking their noses into our business. <laughs> I think I got a little idea. Little sister, no listen, Miguel. Little sister, stay here. Bad people everywhere. Oh, please, Miguel. I promise I won't bother you. I'll be good. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. No. That's not fair. <sighs> Impossible to pick his scent back up. That's too bad. That mandrel was going to lead us to the lair where he stocks his bananas. Oh, well, I can help you. I often see mandrels and elephants transporting crates full of bananas. Uh, they usually go over there. Okay, you see? Over there. Goliath got plan? Yep. We follow Patrick's lead, we find the lair, and we thump. But Mikkel, what did you do? But Goliath say thump! I meant the lair, not on Patrick! Uh... Oops. Sorry, Patrick. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I'll lead you to it, okay? Okay, okay. Uh... Say, Miguel, have you ever met somebody you haven't thumped? Miguel not get thumped Goliath. <sighs> I'm really getting too old for this nonsense. There you go, the last bananas in the jungle. <laughs> Perfect. Why don't you put them with the others? I hope nobody followed you. Oh no, I was super discreet. Gotcha! Where's your boss? Uh, up there. <laughs> Goliath and Miguel, I was waiting for you. Big Tony, I knew you were behind all of this. Look at what I found, Miguel. <laughs> big brother! Little sister! Miguel not happy! Miguel thump Big Tony! Let the kid go, Big Tony. Let's settle this like real rhinos. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm the boss now, Goliath. You better do what I tell you or else. I'll throw the kid to the geyser. Big Brother! Miguel, thump Goliath. We can't take the risk of him hurting Paquita. Do it, Miguel. Thump me. But just pretend to... <coughs> Ouch! I'm too old for this nonsense! Oh, can't you just <coughs> pretend? <coughs> Oops, sorry! Miguel, you see the rock there? I'm gonna pretend to throw you on it. Hmm, okay. 
Ouch! Mr. Goliath really strong. Miguel no pretend to fall. Ouch! Hey, look, Paquita. Your big brother's getting crushed. Miguel, your turn. Shh. Stop moving, or the guys is gonna explode. Paquita, listen to Miguel now. Miguel very worried for little sister. Yes, big brother. Thank you, friends, for saving me. And now, distribute fruit in all jungle. Hmm. For that, I've got an idea. You know, you didn't do too bad in the end, little gorilla. Thank you, friend Anoceros. Now we eat bananas! So what's with that face, Maurice, huh? You're not happy your mom's visiting? Hmm. I think it's awesome. Now that she lives close to the lair, she can come by more often. Yeah, yeah, I'm happy. It'll be great. Hello, everybody. Hi. My grandson. Oh, how you have grown. You look great. Unlike your father, you look awful, Manu. Have a cold? And here we go. Hi, Mom. Don't worry. I'm all right, really. Aren't your stripes a bit off, Manu? Hmm. You think so? No. You should pay a little more attention when you paint them, darling. Oh, Mom! Miguel, happy to see Madame Mom from Mr. Manu. Hmm. Uh, from Mr. Maurice. <laughs> hey there, lovebirds. Hello, Hello Natasha. Natasha. Okay, well, we should probably have lunch. Mom has to leave early. She has quite a journey to get back home. Oh, I have plenty of time, Manu. Would you mind not calling me Manu? Ah, the signal! It's so loud. The neighbors don't complain? Couldn't you find something quieter? It's a signal. It has to be loud. Look, sorry, Mom, but you see, we'll have to do lunch another day. For now, duty calls. The Jungle Bunch! To the, to the rescue! rescue! Good mission! And open... Oh, it's Patrick. Tell me what brings you here. Manu, really? Can't you say hello? Mom, that's my style. And this is Patrick. He's a friend. That's not how I raised you. Huh. Huh. Hello, Mr. Patrick. Nice to see you. To what do we owe this pleasure? <laughs> hello, Great Warrior Minu. Mm. I got a big, big problem because I made a joke to the Kiwis. A joke? How fun! I love jokes. Let's hear it. <laughs> What do you say about a hippopotamus who's having fun? Hmm? That he's hippopotamused. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you guys get it? Okay, so tell us the big problem with the joke. Apart from that, it's not funny. Well, it made the Kiwis laugh, and then they ran into a hippo family having fun, and they immediately thought about my joke, so they started laughing. Mm. And the hippos thought that the kiwis were making fun of them. And now they want to crush their village. So you're not the one with the problem. It's the kiwis. I feel guilty. I couldn't bring myself to go to the hippos and tell them the truth. I was too afraid to get squashed. Manu, mm -hmm. your friends are a little weird, no? Hmm. All right, let's clear up this misunderstanding. But Manu, I just got here and you're leaving. Ooh. Mom, I've got to go. I'm the great warrior tiger, but you can come along if you want. Okay, I'm coming. But promise me to be careful. Yes, I'll be careful, but please stop calling me Manu. Of course, Manu. Over there! Over there! Over there! Oh. 
They really look super stressed. The hippos are probably up there, on the mountain. Patricia, aerial reconnaissance. Hmm? Uh, I mean, please? Hmm. They're up there with a huge rock. They probably want to use it to crush the village. Jungle Bunch, let's go. Hmm? Uh, I mean, please. Hmm. It's all right, guys. We're taking care of the hippos. Oh, the, the jungle, jungle bunch. bunch. Now let's see if the kiwis still want to make fun of us once we've turned them into kiwi smoothies. <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, hippos. We're here to prevent you from making a mistake. Mm -hmm. A really big mistake. Those kiwis, they made fun of us. They have no respect for my family. Maurice, no violence, please. Okay, Mom. And when there's no respect, then we destroy. We crush everything. Yeah. We, we, crush, crush, everything. Everything. we, we crush, crush everything. We crush everything. We Yay. crush everything. Dumpy, dumpy, dumpy. Miguel, take it easy. We're here to talk it over, Patrick. I think you have something to say to the hippos. Uh, hi. Well, the Kiwis weren't making fun of you, you see. They were laughing because I told them a joke. It was a joke about hippos, okay? But I have nothing against hippos. I'm even very good friends with a few hippos. There was a misunderstanding. Neither Patrick nor the Kiwis wanted to make fun of you. Go on, tell them you're sorry, Patrick. I'm very sorry. Well, I guess we're not gonna crush the Kiwis. We just crush Patrick instead. He's the one who disrespected my family. <laughs> <laughs> huh? hmm. Hmm. Nobody is going to fight anyone. Nobody fight nobody. Miguel said. All right, hippos, shake Patrick's paw and let's forget it. There, Mom. See? I did it. And without violence. Well done, Manu. We should always avoid violence when resolving problems. Yes, it's always better to settle problems like that amicably. Well, I mean, especially for your son. And that means... No, no, nothing. Yeah. Oh, nothing? What are you trying to say? Well, come on, look at them. It's obvious. My son's way bigger than yours. Well, you let your son eat all that junk. No wonder he's a bit plump. My Maurice is all muscles. My son? Plump? My Popo, make Mama happy and crush the tiger. Uh, all right, Mama. Dare raise her hand to my son? I'll turn her into a striped carpet. Mom, what did we say? You know the one about the Kiwi who fought? Miguel can thump now, Mr. Maurice? Yes, Miguel. Then the Kiwi fought. You like the joke? Maybe you didn't get it. <gasps> <gasps> Over here, Patrick. I've got you. Dumpy, dumpy, dumpy. I'm going to make you eat your whiskers. Huh? Nobody talks about my son like this. Okay, El Popo. I'll calm my mom down and you calm yours, all right? Okay. You started it, you pachyderm. Oh no! Oh no! Manu!
on, neither of us will make it. Run, Mom! Jump! No way. If I let go, you're going to get crushed. You jump. But, Mom, I'm the great warrior tiger. I always make it. That may be so, but I won't leave you. I won't let my Manu get crushed. Hmm. We're never going to be able to stop it. I love you, Manu. I love you, Mom. So sweet, a mom and her son risking their lives together. Hmm. Thank you, Jacobite! <laughs> Thank you, my friends. Ah, you look a lot less stressed. Well, we are sorry. We lost our temper a little bit. We're a little sensitive about the family. All's well that ends well, my friends. That's right. Thanks to the great warrior tiger who always makes it. And thanks to all of you for saving our lives. Well, then how about a joke to celebrate? No, 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 no. So it's the story of a kiwi. And, well, uh, the hippo looks at the kiwi and the... Uh, where are we going? Not everyone likes your jokes, Patrick. You're going back home. Do you know the story of the crazy bat? No? Everyone tells him, you so bats, bat. <laughs> Patricia, can we just drop him? No, Gilbert, we're not gonna drop him. 